Hello and happy Friday! Welcome to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Christiane Marguerite. I am an outdoorsy adventurer and racial justice organizer. I had a busy day today. It's already 2 p.m. I had to listen in to a judicial committee hearing for the Ban the Burn at Every Turn Act, which is an environmental justice legislation that we're trying to pass here in Baltimore City. Um, I had to listen into that to see whether or not they were going to pass it today um, so that I could update my team and my organization on that this morning. And then I showered and did some more work and cleaned up the home a little bit and my client just came um, and dropped off a dog. This is sweet boy Sammy. Sammy! Hi Sammy boy! Hi sweetie boy! Hi Angel! You an angel! Good boy Bubsy, nice play! They're playing so well together. I can't believe it's already 2 p.m. I haven't even eaten anything, so I'm about to eat some yogurt with granola right now, um, or maybe even a bigger lunch, actually. But yeah, welcome to my work day on a Friday. Um, thankfully, I do have a little bit more of a relaxed afternoon. We are rolling out our endorsements, our candidate endorsements for the November elections. I actually also did that this morning. I forgot. It's been it's been a wild ride of a morning, um, and I also just just finished editing a letter to the House and Senate uh, Democratic caucuses for our state on behalf of our organization. So that's gonna also go out this afternoon. Sorry about the noise. The boys are playing, they're being super loud, but let's get something to eat. And then I'm gonna build my furniture today. Finally, I know I've been attempting to do that the past few days and I have not, but it's here and I'm so excited to build it. So let's eat, finish up work, and then we're gonna build some furniture. Yogurt and granola is where it's at. So I also have yogurt, granola, almonds, and chia seeds is what those little black things are. I love chia seeds. So I'm also about to try this monk fruit sweetener for the first time um i got it at home goods um but i was eyeing it on amazon and it was cheaper at home goods it's sugar free and it's keto and i bought this it's supposed to be maple flavored i bought it because i ran out of my agave which i was using for a while instead of honey um just to kind of test that out i i definitely like honey the best oh this actually smells like maple syrup it doesn't smell that bad i think i'm just gonna pour like Oh, oh my gosh, that was a lot. That was a lot. The like opening for this is just not very good. But I'm gonna pour a little bit. Okay, all right. Well, that was a lot of maple syrup, so it's probably gonna be good. It's probably gonna be sweet. But it says it's keto. It says it's zero sugar, one net carb. I don't know. We'll see. Let's see. It's not bad. It's not bad. It definitely tastes like, what's it called? Sweet and low. It tastes like sweet and low. Not my favorite. An acquired taste, but um, we could do this. We could, we could do this. We stand, we stand. All right, and we are walking right now to go and pick up our race packets because we're running a 5k tomorrow a 5k trail run actually at Patapsco State Park um, on a trail that we know and love actually we're very excited and we're gonna go pick up our packets we haven't done an in-person like run in a really long time so we're really interested to see how it's gonna be during COVID should definitely be interesting but It'll be bright and early tomorrow, so we're looking forward to it. And the packet pickup is actually in our neighborhood, so super close by. <laughs> We just picked up our race packets 
and we're so excited. Yo, this is awesome. It says Black Women Hike Baltimore and it says the Alpha Female Fest. There's a t-shirt, a mask, a wrist bracelet, some like informational stuff. This is amazing. We can't wait until tomorrow for Black Women Hike Baltimore 2020. Woo! Okay, y'all, the time has finally come. I've been waiting for this for a few days now. I am finally going to build my Homefa bookcase, the sister bookcase to one that I already have on that wall back near the kitchen. So let's do this. I feel like I've been putting this off because when I built the other one, which is slightly smaller, it took me like two to three hours. And uh, well, it's nine o'clock. Oh, actually it's 8.30, it's 8.30. So let's see if we can finish this before 11, two and a half hours. All right, no more talking, let's go.
base, the little magnet looks great. And I just finished the doors and they look so good. They're awesome, I'm obsessed with them. They're so cute. Can't wait to put them on. I'm literally sweating, but I finished it, which I'm so happy about. I literally love it. Again, that was the first piece we had. This is this one. It's like a little bit taller. I'll likely decorate it tomorrow. It's just past 11 p.m., so it's very late. Lucy's actually already upstairs sleeping, so I'm gonna go catch up with her and go to sleep because we do have to be awake in seven hours for race day tomorrow. So I'm gonna close this out here. If you do like this kind of content, remember to go ahead and hit that subscribe button below. I am vlogging every single day for this month. I'm trying very hard to keep that up. Um, and today is day three, so please keep up with me, like these videos, and don't forget to subscribe. Love you all, see you tomorrow, bye.